We arrived to this research from an open evolutionary question because plants have a lot to benefit potentially from emitting sounds and from responding to sounds. The plants are surrounded by many organisms that can respond to sounds, yet plants were considered entirely mute. And we came to test this question. So if plants were emitting sounds at the hearing range, we would have known that already. So we tested the sounds emitted by plants in the ultrasonic range. And we found that indeed, plants emit sounds, and these sounds contain information. In this study, we've shown that plants emit ultrasonic sound signals, signals that are above the human audible range. In order to record such signals, one needs special microphones, microphones that are sensitive to ultrasound. We're recording sounds emitted by tomato plants, but these sounds are ultrasonic sounds, so we humans can't hear them. In order to, to show what these sounds are like, we took many sounds, we put them together in a small time frame, and we changed the frequency so human ears can, can hear them. This is an example of such a manipulation we did on tomato sounds that we recorded. And these are sounds that were recorded from grapevines and manipulated in, in the same manner. So, one of our subjects was tomato plant. When a tomato plant is uh, feeling well, it emits very few sounds. But when it is stressed, when it is dehydrated or cut or sick, it emits plenty of sounds. And we can uh, tell the type of stress and the species of the plant from these sounds. These results have several implications. First, it means that in many cases, plants that uh, we see outside that appear stressed are also emitting sounds, only we do not hear them. Second, it might mean that someone is listening to these sounds. The sounds are out there and contain information and both animals that can hear these sounds can respond to them and possibly uh, we are testing whether plants can respond to the sounds of stressed plants. Finally, there is also a potential for an agricultural uh, advantage. It might be an additional way to monitor plant and particularly plant stress without touching the plant.